Okay, so I made it inside this place and this is super beautiful. I think this is kind of like a little courtyard area. And the casino's over there and I'm not gonna take the camera over there because they're gonna just shut me down real quick. So we can go walk around and check this place out, but supposedly this is like the nicest hotel casino in the Philippines right now, or like the most, it's got the most hype, the most, this is like newly built. And this is supposed to be the one. So, so far, this place is pretty intense. It's, I didn't realize that it's kind of like a shopping mall slash casino slash hotel slash like event venue, I guess. But it's absolutely gorgeous. This is really, really nice. They got Jollibean here, Starbucks. It's all Texas Roadhouse for all the you people from the US watching this. I don't know if you can throw the peanuts on the floor in this one though. So this casino is massive. I'm, not, I'm sure I'm not allowed to film in here, but it goes way down there. I mean, way down there. Crazy far down there. And it is huge. It goes way over there, way over there. It goes far, far. And I got lucky. I just won a uh, thousand pesos, which is uh, about $20. So I got lucky. I'm gonna take my earnings and run out of here and before security tells me to stop filming in the casino. So this lobby to this place is just gorgeous. Check this out. I mean, it's beautiful. I mean, this is crazy. And that casino, that casino is massive. That place is huge. Seriously, that's one of the, other than Las Vegas, that's one of the biggest casinos I've ever been in. It was insanely big. Tons of gambling going on here. Dangerous place. Okay, so right now there's this part, it's called the scenic zone. And I think it's like this whole area and it's got like all these shops that go down there. Oh, they even got a little mini McDonald's. And what's crazy is they got a map right here. And look, you can see the yellow part is where I'm at. And look how massive this place is. This place is huge. And I'm not sure if they're just still working on it or if it's, they're remodeling it. But once this place is done and it's rocking, this place is gonna be insane. This is gonna be insane. And what's crazy is this area, this area has like a bunch of hotels and, and casinos. So I think this is gonna be like the kind of like Las Vegas of the Philippines, like a, or like the Macau of the Philippines. So pretty interesting. It actually looks like this is gonna be like a, uh, like a big Photoshop area or something. Cause it's like, they got the sunflowers, Candyland. I'm not sure what this is. This looks like some, I don't even know, maybe some old Western style. I think it looks like San Francisco or Hong Kong, maybe. And then they got this thing too. Just like this. I don't know if it's going to be like a theater or a restaurant. But this place is no joke. So I was just looking online the cost of staying here and it seems like it's about 14 or 15,000 pesos per night. And I don't know if that's, that's expensive or if that's as expensive as it gets or not and that's about uh 300 us per night so that place was awesome for sure i definitely recommend going there i will say though they're doing a lot of construction and it seems things like that but if you just want to go check out the casino and have a nice place to stay it's still great there i had to take my thousand pistols and winnings and get out of there so anyways i hope you enjoyed this video thanks for watching and we'll see you next time <music>